The Pioneer Place on Fifth Theater here in St. Cloud is opening their 14th season tonight with the musical Little Shop of Horrors. The darkly comedic rock musical based on the 1960 film tells the story of a nerdy flower shop worker who ends up growing a man-eating plant. Uh, ever since I saw the movie with Rick Moranis and Ellen Green many, many years ago, uh, and I've always wanted to do this show, but I was always a little bit leery of it uh, because of the size of our space. Uh, as many people know who've seen the movie, this plant continues to grow and grow and grow. And uh, so I, th I figured we would have challenges with that. Um, but due to the ingenious design of our uh, production manager and scenic designer, Justin Hooper, um, he has designed a, a series of plants that is nothing short of uh, unbelievable. And it's, uh, it really works for our space and it's great. So it began being talked about about three months ago. Um, and uh, it was designed about two months ago, uh, and then we start to draft plans and how, you know, decide how we're going to build it and what materials we're going to use and how we can keep it within the budget of the theater um, and all that. Uh, and then, just over the last few weeks, uh, it was built uh, by our technical director Adam Terry um, in his shop off site. Uh, which is really just his garage, and uh, and then it gets brought over here, and we have a week to put it up and paint it all and make it look good. People see opening night. I have eight great actors and about fifteen band and production people that uh, have all their own very brilliant creative minds. So it's 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 exciting at this point where we're at right now, where everything gets to start to come together. for four weekends, which is a change for us. We typically run three weekends, uh, but because uh, we knew that there was going to be uh, uh, a lot of interest in the show and just because it's such a popular title, uh, we're going to run it for a month. So we're going to run it Thursdays through Sundays all the way through October 7th.